Hi everybody, I'm going to share with you guys my outfit of the day. I'm wearing a summery dress and a hat. It's pretty warm outside today so I like to wear hats when it's warm just to kind of give me a little bit of shade and protect my makeup a little bit and I don't know. It just helps with me and like sweating and my makeup all running down my face. Hats are just really good for that. <laughs> they give me a little shade. But also this outfit is very affordable. I know I get questions a lot about uh, shopping on a budget and how to be fashionable on a budget. Like all this stuff I'm wearing is really very affordable. And what I do usually is just look on the clearance racks. That's like the main thing to budget shopping that I do. I look for sales and look on the clearance racks. This hat was like originally um, I think $27 at Kohl's and then they had marked it down to $15. And then I had a coupon for $10 off, so I got the hat for $5. And then I found this necklace, the pearl necklace on sale at Old Navy, and it was like $5, I think. But it's, it looks really nice, and it'll go with a lot of things, so I'll get a lot of use out of it. The shrug was, I think, $10 or $13 at Dots, and it's another one of those basic pieces that I'll wear over and over and over. And then the camisole I got at Old Navy is probably like 7 or 8 bucks, and again, I'll wear it over and over but basically I just I look online I look in stores I try to find sales and deals um, if it's a trendy thing I don't want to spend a lot of money on it because trends come and go quickly but you guys do know I have some like higher end purses and jewelry and stuff and that's because it's likely to with withstand the test of time and be around for several years you know I have Louis Vuittons but I see people from way back when carrying Louis, Louis Vuittons so they're likely to still be in fashion in decades to come so I've spent money on those kind of things and then skip things that are just kind of trendy for the moment but you know it's not going to be around in five years <laughs> so that's what I do or if I do want one of those trendy items I just won't pay a lot of money I'll go to dots or I'll look on a clearance rack but basically that's pretty much what I do when I shop and if you are shopping on a budget that's what I would suggest so um, now let me scoot back and show you guys what I'm wearing today. Okay, so I'm wearing this nice blue and off-white kind of khaki-ish color flower dress. And it's from Old Navy and I got it on the clearance rack. It's got a very deep V so I put a camisole underneath. If you have dresses like that but you don't want to wear them certain places because they're so deep, just put a camisole underneath and that'll solve your problem pretty quickly. And I just put, you know, the shrug from Dots with it hat is from Kohl's. Shoes are Madden Girl, if you can see them from there. <laughs> I'll, I'll go closer so you can see them. But yeah, this is my outfit of the day. So these are the shoes I'm wearing from Madden Girl. They're the nude peep toe pumps that you guys have seen before from me. They have a sling back, a little bit of a platform. And I really like them. Here's what they look like a little closer. And then I'm carrying my clutch again from Straw Studios that I got at TJ Maxx for $19.99. It's $100 on their website, I've said before, so that's a pretty big deal. TJ Maxx is another really great resource if you want to look for um, more name brand and some designer kind of stuff, but at a reasonable price or a more reasonable price, then TJ Maxx is really good for that. So I got this from there. And it just unlocks right here. See it like that. Then I'm just wearing my Feed Projects bracelet again, my Feed 5 bracelet. And yeah, it's my outfit of the day. I hope you guys are having a great day. And I'll talk to you guys again soon. Bye, everybody.